Okay, welcome back to Bad North, where, uh, well, I, uh, I'm i going strong still. I've got five commanders. I just got Ida Lisa last episode, and, uh, well, I guess let's give her, let's give her team a profession. Right now she's just a bunch of, a bunch of people with swords. Uh, that she's leading just a bunch of people with swords. I think what I want is I think I want either some more Some more people with shields or some more people with bows I think people with shields are more useful because they can defend themselves more than bow people can the bows are just good at whittling down large numbers of people But so are the people with shields or at least they can defend against large numbers of people So this should be uh, I think shields are what I want Yes, so there we are. We've got shield people, two shield two shield groups and one and one archer group and then two pike groups. I think that should be just fine. I still need to use this. I still need to use this axe. I don't know if this battle a warhammer, sorry. I don't know if it just automatically uh gets used by this group, Oscar's group, or if I have to press a certain <clears throat> button to do it. Well, anyways, uh would you look at this? This island up here, look at how many how many houses are on that island. Can you imagine how much money you could make from defending that island? Yeah, I want to go there. That's what I'm trying to say. So um, let's uh, try and get up there. Right now, I need to refresh all of my commanders. Then I could get to the to the island of On. So let's go to On. Now, what's happening here, here on On? Uh, wow, that's an interesting layout. So there are a bunch of cave openings, or two cave openings. This is just kind of an arch. And then one house up here where everyone has to walk up this steep, steep, uh, almost like natural staircase to get up there. And then a, a little small high, small house down there. It shouldn't be too hard to defend. And, uh, oh, yet, yet again, it's these two faces. I don't know which is which, but there n there's not going to be any archers. That's for certain. So, no archers. Well, who will I bring? I think I'll only bring two of these of these guys. I think I'll bring the... The archers? And then maybe, uh... I don't know. The pikes? I don't need the shields to defend against arrows. So, let's not bring the shields. Let's not bring two pikes, at least. Uh, I could, I could go with Ida Lisa, but then again, I mean, she has, uh, she's got shields, so I think, I think it should be all right with just Taya and Lucan. Let's go. Right. So we're defending against some more Vikings today, and I thought it might be interesting for you to know. Interesting for me to just uh, say that I. Of course, if you've been watching this channel, you'll know that I have Danish roots. Oh, there are two ways to go about this. These people could either go through the island or around the island. Well, or could they go around? I think they could. Well, I guess I just want to uh, place my pipe guard, pipe guys down here. Not right, not right in the middle of this action. Then, then, then they'll just be overwhelmed. But I think if they're standing there, they can defend both the cave opening and this uh, this beach over here. Now, where are people coming from now? Over there, and they've got shields. Do I place my? Oh no, I don't. I don't. I place my guys here. That's where I want them. And uh, I guess I'll try. Guess I'll try using uh, bow people down here. All right, but what I was gonna say is, I have I am from Denmark, so of course I have Danish ancestry. All of my uh, forefathers were all. Hey, hey, get over here! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! All my archers, my all, my archers, don't, don't get killed, archers, please. No, archers, get away from there. No. Okay. That was bad. That was really bad. Um, I guess I shouldn't have brought archers to a, so a shield fight. Didn't think of that. I guess... I, ju I guess I'll just let them have... I'll just let them have this, uh, this house down here. There's no way I'm going to be defending that. Not with... Not, not with 
this few people. So, I think what I just gotta do is stand here and hope that a bunch of pikes... Oh, man. Are gonna be able to defend against this whole horde of vikings coming up the stairs now. I think they are. Some of them just got knocked down the stairs, but it doesn't seem they die from that. They got knocked all the way down there. Do, do you see how huge these houses, or how small these houses are? If these houses were normal size, then you definitely wouldn't be able to survive a fall like that. Well, anyways, about my ancestry. I like doing genealogy, and through my genealogy, I found out that some of the oldest people in my uh, lineage, I guess, in my family, some of the oldest people that I stem from uh, were not Vikings. <laughs> Yeah, I know it might have sounded like that was where what, where I was going with that, but no, they're not. They were not Vikings, at least not that I can, like, discern for sure, for certain. But some of the oldest people in my family they came from Norway, uh, not Denmark, where I live, where I live. Um, and these uh, Norwegians, it was uh, the oldest one that I know of, and I can't for sure say that this guy existed. Uh, his son definitely existed, but I don't know about the this last uh, generation. I mean, it was all the way back in the 1500s. Um, the, the oldest guy that I've heard of in my family is a monk. Uh, I know monks didn't have children, but it, this is because this monk, uh, when the Reformation happened, he uh, he moved away from the from the uh, well the monastery the yeah the monastery, and he um, became a, a re reformative. A, a priest after the Reformation, so so he was he was allowed to have kids after the Reformation. That's what I'm trying to say. So he had kids, and and I uh, am one of his probably millions or at least thousands of yeah millions of of uh, descendants because people from the 1500s they they have a lot of descendants nowadays. Uh, so what I'm trying to say is this guy apparently he claimed that he he was a descendant of a Viking uh, called Ketil Krok. Who was in a battle uh, in one of the, <laughs> these these kind of battles in this game? Uh, I can't say that Kettle Krok was a Viking because he was actually of uh, British descent, but he fought with the Vikings. You can actually read about him. Kettle Krok was a, an actual historical figure. Um, he fought with uh, King Hardrada, and I think his grandfather was the king of England way back in the day in the in the you know in the year thousand or something. Uh, no, I think it's, it was actually in the 900s, even earlier than that. Okay, so um, what am I doing here? I'm bringing, I'm bringing Oscar, my shield, two, my, my two shield guys, or gals, and some pikes to a fight against just this one type of enemy. I guess this is where we get to see what kind of enemy this is—the one with the stripe, the white stripe down the, down the helmet. Let's see. Let's just let's just fight. I'm not afraid. I think we can do this. We've got three armies against just one one type of dude, and it's either going to be the ones that have shields or the ones that don't have anything, just just swords. So I'm not afraid. It's going to be the ones with shields. Okay, so let's let's remember that the guys with uh, with stripes down their down their helmets are the guys that have shields. This seems a bit overkill. And they're dead. Alright, so where are the next people coming from? Where are they coming from? The reason I'm defending this island here, even though they don't have a lot of houses, is because I did... I just... I had these three armies that I had to use for something, right? I couldn't just not use these armies now that I, I've got them. I mean, I could just wait until the next round, or the next turn, I guess, and just... Um, I, I unfatigue my other armies, but what's the use of that? I think I could. Uh, I think I, I'll definitely be able to win this. Win this fight with only three armies. Now let's see here. Let's see how it goes. Sure enough, I mean, seems like an easy win. Oh, my my little brother is coming home from college, <laughs> right outside my window right now. <laughs> awesome. Well, uh, okay, I guess. I'll put some da guys down here, and then I'll, <laughs> and then I'll, I'll just pause. Let's see how this battle goes, and then. Oh, 
yay, I, I, uh, I survived. <laughs> I gotta go out there and greet him. So, um, let me just pause the game. Let me just leave the game for now. Alrighty, my break is over. Uh, it ended, ended up taking nine hours, but um, now I'm back and uh, ready to record again. The house was just filled with people, and I didn't feel comfortable just sitting in here yelling at my screen. But now people are watching uh, the television. My brother is uh, at a party, birthday party, I think. So um, we should be good to go. Um, but I did realize that I don't have enough... I don't think I, I'm going to have enough time to record a whole lot more in, the, in these Christmas days. Uh, the days just around Christmas Eve and uh, Christmas Day. So um, I, 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 do think, I do think I'll have to record the last couple episodes of the Advent Calendar here tonight. Uh, which should be fine. I mean, there are only uh, one left after this one. Well, at least I just decided we're going to end it with the 24th. And that's, that's going to be it. Now... This episode is not over yet. We still want to go to LON, this huge island with all of these houses. I want to bring all of my uh, champions, what do you call them, commanders. So let's, uh, I guess, heal them up, reactivate uh, them. And now I should be able to bring all of them, or at least four of them, to one of these battles. It's going to be this one. Here we go. Now, we've got a large... A large, very flat island with lots of houses. I don't think the houses will be a problem in terms of being able to navigate around them all. Uh, there seems to be plenty of space. Uh, but, I mean, it's very flat and there are a lot of houses to, um, to protect. And I'm going to be fighting against every single type of enemy there is. So this is going to be <laughs> some battle. Let's just say it like that. Am I going to need... Um, I think I'm going to need it all. I actually, honestly, think I'm going to need it all. Will I need more, um, more of the, uh, what, what, what are these called again? I totally forgot what these spears are called. Well, spears, you know what I mean. Will I need more of those, or will I need two, two of the ones with swords, or with shields? I think shields will be more, I think I want shields instead of swords. So let's uh, get Idaliza back on the team and let's deploy. I really hope this is gonna go well. I honestly don't know how I feel about this. Now, where are people coming from? Over there. Okay, so they have bows. They have bows. So who has swords here? These people have, oh sorry, shields. People with shields go over there. Now, people are also coming from over there. Let's send my pike. Oh, pikes! That was that's what they're called. Let's send, send our pikes over there. There we are. All right. So who who else is coming? And this should be fine. All right. So people are coming from over here. Oh, in hordes. Okay. Let's send our archers over over here to hopefully whittle down on this boat right here. This huge ship. No, what? No, don't shoot. Don't shoot at, shoot at those people. Uh, now we need the people with... Where are the people? Are these the people with shields? I think these are the people with shields. Oh, and let's have these guys also with shields go... Oh, wait, I killed them all. Great. So who are these people? These people, okay. These don't have shields. Anyone else coming? Okay, I, I'm, I'm not as afraid anymore for my life as I was before. Let's have some other people go up here for backup. And killed. Now, that, that surely wasn't the last group of people, no. Let's shoot at these guys while they get over here. Now, anyone else coming? Not right now. Okay, okay, you, you need to go. This is not safe for you anymore. You need to go all the way inland while while the shield people take care of this. You need to you need to stay in here. It, but there's only only the leader, Lucan, of that battalion left. That is not good. Okay, let's hope. Um, let's hope at least. Oh, okay. Last wave isn't coming. Where's it coming from? over there. 
Okay. Are the bow people? There are bow people. It's actually solely, solely gonna be bow people. Let's um, let's get this army down there. They are. Yeah, it's just bow people. Okay. Let's uh, let's get. Our, I'm glad I chose so many shields uh, instead of pikes because I really didn't get to use these pikes very much. Come on, don't die. Yeah, like that. How much money am I gonna get? Six? Eight? 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 15 money. <laughs> 15 gold coins. How about that? That is a lot. That's like three times what I what I've got on some so, gotten on some of these others other missions. And I didn't even lose didn't even lose Lucan, even though I almost did. I'm glad I kept an eye on him. Alright, so let's continue now. Let's let's buy some upgrades. You should have seen it, Gareth. You should have been there. Now, 34 coins. Oh, I didn't even use my barrage or whatever whatever it's called. Oh, man. I really... Wait, I, have I... Yes, I did buy it. What's this, then? More arrows fired in each volley. <laughs> I haven't even used any of them that yet. Uh, oh, I could... Uh, ah, I could upgrade my, ar my veteran archers to become elite archers. Maximum accuracy and fi rate of fire and damage. That that does sound good. I am pretty happy with uh, with how they work right now, right. actually. So maybe I should go and upgrade someone else. Uh, what 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 were these able to do? Hold their ground for longer. Yeah, I don't know what that's about. Mm. I don't really care about that right now. Let's let's get some veteran some veteran infantry. Uh, tougher, stronger, more effective. I mean, why not? Twelve coins. That's enough. There we are. So now we've got veterans. Um, we still got plenty more money, so I guess let's let's upgrade these uh, pikes too. Buy that upgrade, like that. Okay, now we only got ten coins. Uh, oh crap! I yeah, I totally forgot to use my ability. This uh, arrow bum 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 bombing <laughs> bombardment. Um, let's buy this ability. What was this again? Perform a jumping attack from a cliff onto enemies below. That's pretty cool. Let's do that. And um, yeah, let's buy that. And let's let, let's do it next time because this episode is about to be over. Thank you for watching this episode of the Advent Calendar with Ham Frags. It's just about to be over, isn't it? I mean, today is the big day. Sorry, tomorrow is the big day. Christmas Eve, at least. That's the big day in Denmark. I know some people celebrate Christmas morning. Uh, well, anyways, it's just about to be the last episode tomorrow. Let's see how far we get. Maybe we'll even have a special 25th episode. Who knows? Stay tuned. Bye-bye. If you liked it, that's great.